What's up everyone, welcome back to Blade Bias. I made a video a few weeks ago, I believe, talking about bushings versus bearings, and I wanted to hear you guys' opinions on it, because I wanted to do a video about bushings versus bearings, but I also wanted some community feedback to go off of in that video. And you guys gave me some amazing feedback, so I'm finally going to do the bushing versus bearing video that I've wanted to do for a while. Because bushings and bearings are very, very divisive in the community. A lot of people aren't a fan of bushings. A lot of people hate bearings with every fiber of their being. Um, some people flip washer knives and they're that meme of the two people fighting and then there's the one dude like doing the weird like thing with I think it's like a uh, he's using an apparatus of some sort but there's yeah bushing versus bearings and then washers are just over there enjoying themselves anyway um, from the large majority of people that commented on this video some preferred bushings, some preferred bearings, as I expected. But there were a lot of people that brought up really good points. Um, and I do want to make a correction. In that video, I said bushings are easier to implement. The wording that I used in that sentence was wrong. Bushings are easier to implement to make feel good. Even if you have an undersized bushing, the knife will still feel good to flip as long as it's properly tuned. Whereas a bearing knife, if you use the wrong bearings, the bearings can make the action feel really, really bad, which is more what I meant. It's easier to make a bearing ballast or a bushing ballast on feel good, not to implement bushings because you have to tune bushings and you have to make them like actually work. So bearings are easier to implement, but I think bushings are easier to make feel, make the swing feel good. Hopefully that clears up everything. But from a large majority of people who commented on that video, it seems like people actually really like bearings. Um, some people feel that they're somewhat uncontrollable. A lot of people feel that they feel really nice and controlled. Um, people seem to like the, uh, the smoothness of bearings. I guess I should flip a bearing ballast on while I'm talking about them. People like how smooth and flowy that bearings can be. Um, they also just like how cheap they can make knives. One really good point that was brought up is that there aren't many good offerings with bearings in them. You have like the Flytanium Lucha, which is a knife that I personally really don't like. You have the Stock Lucha, which is a knife that most people wouldn't flip for fun, I feel like. You have the Talisong Z, which is a fantastic experience, but like those are the ones that really come to mind in like the mid-range like Kraken area. I'm obviously forgetting a bunch, but I can't really think of too many like easily accessible, really, really good bearing knives. Because you could say the Bermuda all you want, but this is not accessible. And it's also not really, really good. I'd say it's just okay. Um, bushings, people said that they just liked because they just felt more controlled um, and they like the tuning aspects of it, as I brought up in the video. Bearings, you have to tune like a washer knife, whereas bushings, you can just kind of crank down the screws and not really worry about it too much. I prefer that. That's the main reason I like bushings. Yes, you can use thread locker, but thread locker will fade eventually, and you have to do it again, and it's just annoying. Whereas the Prisma, I can't remember the last time I touched with a screwdriver. <laughs> like, it's just rock solid. Um, there was someone who brought up, I believe it was on the job flips, brought up something very interesting, which was the idea of press fit bearings, I believe they were called, which is bear, a bearing knife that you don't have to tune like a bearing knife because they, you can tighten the screws all the way down, excuse me, all the way down like you would a bushing. And I know nothing about press fit bearings or how hard they are to implement so allow me to tell people what to do who do know something about them and it might not even be possible this is this joke is just not as someone who knows nothing about press fit bearings let me now tell you uh to use press fit bearings even though i don't know if it's possible or not i would love to see a ballast song with press fit bearings i don't know how possible that is but holy cow, a bearing knife that you could just tighten down all the way sounds like a dream. 
and that would be really really awesome i would actually love to see that like that'd be really cool top 10 dream battle songs for sure um but let's just let's just wrap everything up let's go down the the list bearings um, don't feel as smooth if they're not implemented well. Can feel a little bit more uncontrollable for most people, um, but are nice and flowy for others. They allow a very friction-free swing on your balisong. They definitely require a different flipping style, as Ty has mentioned before to me. I'm not sure if he said in a video, but he says you have to be a lot slower with the Bermuda. You have to be a lot more methodical, which I definitely agree with. You can't just flip this thing and crank it like you would a Prisma. Um, they don't tune up the best. You have to tune them like washer knives, which to me is kind of annoying, but they're certainly good. I just think they're harder to get really correct because bad bearings can make your, uh, your swing feel awful. Bushings, on the other hand, are slightly more controlled. Tolerances, oh, that's another, tolerances on bearing knives are much, much better because you can have bearing knives that don't even wiggle a little bit when you shake them. Whereas bushings are always going to have that little wiggle. You can tune them better. Um, you can crank down the screws. They just feel a bit more controlled because there's friction. Their swing isn't just free. You can't just like have free swing whenever you want like you would with bearings. They're also just more universal. There's more good options of bushing balisongs out there than there really are of like bearing balisongs. And... I think bushings are just generally the more accepted experience. Um, and then you have washers, which I'm not going to talk about because I don't really like. I don't even own a washer knife besides the tape flipper, but I don't even count the tape flipper because it tunes so well. Uh, there are also other options. I know some people were talking about like press fit, press fit bearings, which I don't really think we'll see in a balisong. Uh, anytime soon but pretty much both of them have their upsides both of them have their downsides i don't really think either one deserves to be hated like they are by the community specifically bearings are hated by the community um but all together just seeing if i forgot anything bearings makes the ballast song shake the vibration makes the screws come loose that's a good point um but generally like i think we just need some better offerings on bearings to really get people into bearings we just need some better bearing knives um, but that's just my take let me know what you think in the comments and i will see you all in the next one peace